Hello, it's Chief Tech Help here today, and today I'm going to be telling you how to install uh, Steam within Ubuntu. So to do this, you need to install Wine, which allows Steam to run. So you've got to so first go to your web browser, in this case Firefox, and uh, search for Wine. It should be the website www.winehq.org. Go onto that website, click Download, go to Download Ubuntu Packages and then scroll down it gives you the instructions here so you need to copy and paste this line here it says PPA Ubuntu Wine PPA link in description um, and code in description as well then you want to go to software sources I mean sorry you need to go to Ubuntu Software Center then go to edit software sources and type in your password then go to other software Go to add, paste the line in, press add source, close, wait while this updates the cache, close Ubuntu Software Center, scroll down, click here to get the most recent Wine 1.3 beta, click here to install, click that, press OK, wait and then click install type in your password yet again and wait and uh, I've finished installing uh, Wine now so once that's installed you're going to go up to the top if you're on Ubuntu Classic you need to go to uh, the Wine menu and go to Wine Tricks so what we're going to do on Unity is just search in Wine Tricks see this pretty logo here and it will uh, say your Wine configuration is being updated now go to install an app, press OK. Then scroll down until you find Steam. You can also install other things here as well, such as uTorrent, VLC, Winamp, SketchUp, Safari, uh, Opera, Paint, uh, Amazon Kindle Reader, Firefox, uh, AutoHotKey, things like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and do Steam for now. Press OK. Uh, it will ask you if you wish to support the development, you can choose this, I'm going to click yes to be nice and help the people out who create this software and it will just say uh, press ok and it will go ahead and install so it will install it line with the uh, installer like you see on windows, so just go ahead and install it just go ahead and install it just like a normal windows program and we press finish then it's going to go ahead and do some workarounds so it'll end up downloading some fonts that you need Arial, Bold, Comic Sans, Korea, Georgia, Impact, Times New Roman, Trebuchet, uh, Verding, I can't remember that, Web Webdings, and that's it so it'll also disable the game overlay renderer and that's it so you've now installed Steam within Linux. It's still quite not as good as if you were running it on Windows and sometimes when you move the windows around it kind of bugs out but other than that you can uh, download and play some of your games on Linux. Thank you for watching.